Hello guys, it's Unders. I hope today is finding you well. So really quick video today in Logic Pro in 10.4, there's now the ability to automatically assign colors as you introduce new tracks. Really helpful for organization. However, the manual's explanation is awful and I've already seen a bunch of questions about it. So let's just throw out really quickly how to do it. I'm gonna blaze through this. So if we go into Logic and we go into Preferences, we're gonna grab General. If we then choose Display, we're gonna to go to Tracks. In Color, instead of Static, we're gonna choose Auto Progress 24. You can choose Auto Progress 96 if you're gonna have a really intense session. This will give a slightly different gradient in the colors. Progress 24 should be fine unless you're recording a huge, huge amount of audio or if you are someone who goes into like the 100 plus track marker all the time. So once we've done that, now when we create a new track, depending on the initial color type of the track, it will choose the sequential color palettes across. So if we do Option, Command and N to create a new track, we've currently got it selected an audio. Let's choose 50 new audio tracks hit create and there they are sequentially done in color all right now if we just undo that real quick go back into our display settings just here and we can just put it on the auto progress 96 as well and I can just show you what that does differently you saw before that the colors started to loop after about uh, 12 to 13 versions of itself. We go through that one. Yeah, and you see we just get a slightly different gradient there and it gives us a, a longer amount of tracks before we go and repeat the same color over. So I hope that answers the question of how you set it up and how you use it. I will see you guys on the next video.